stop and go on the Ike. It's what you can expect when driving on the Eisenhower. It's one Illinois expressway that is likely to get a much needed upgrade under the massive infrastructure bill signed into law today. Illinois slice will be 17 billion. There is an opportunity for billions of uh, dollars more for a variety of projects that we can apply for, and we will be doing that. Governor J.B. Pritzker, who attended the White House bill signing ceremony, says the $17 billion is a welcome addition to the $45 billion the state of Illinois is already spending on infrastructure after state lawmakers passed a plan in 2019. Even though we did pass Rebuild Illinois a couple years ago, we still have a tremendous backlog of maintenance, um, so that should be the first thing we do. The Metropolitan Planning Council is calling for maintenance and modernization of roads and bridges, big and small. Besides transportation, the bill also includes money for electric vehicle charging stations, internet expansion, and upgrades to the water system. Using the money to replace old lead pipes is likely to be a big priority in the city of Chicago. Um, it will make a, a significant uh, difference, uh, not only uh, to expand uh, the number of homes that we can reach, uh, but also sh um, shorten the time period. Mayor Lori Lightfoot, who attended the ceremony as well, says the money will also be used to finally expand the red line beyond 95th Street. And while it is a historic amount of money going to all the states, the Metropolitan Planning Council is concerned about how it will be spent. And what's really important is that we do this in a thoughtful and transparent way so that people know how the public funds are being spent, why projects are pre being prioritized. And however it is spent, it is likely to create thousands of new jobs in Illinois. Sarah Schulte, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.